Good morning, everybody. It's Tuesday morning. We're starting a week in my life in New York City. We have a very fun week ahead of us. Today is a very busy, very fun day. It's still fashion week technically, um, but two of my looks that I really wanted to wear, um, I wasn't able to wear to the specific events because of like timing. So I'm actually going to Soho this morning and shooting those looks because they're epic and I love shooting in Soho. If you ever visit New York, it's really fun to take photos over there because there's all the columns, the architecture is just beautiful, the cobble streets, Green Street is very popular. Um, I don't know, I don't normally do stuff like this, but it's still fashion week and I still wanna take photos in these outfits. And then after that, I'm going to an event for Elemis. Um, Tegan, also known as Half Baked Harvest, is hosting it, which is really fun. It's at Palma, which is a beautiful restaurant in the West Village. And then after that, I come home and my dad lands in New York City. My dad goes to Atlantic City every year with his college best friends and uh, it's usually around fashion week, so he comes to New York City for a couple days beforehand, so he'll be landing today. Um, then I'm actually headed to the podcast studio with Brooke and we're having on Morgan Riddle on Gals on the Go, which is really exciting. A lot of people have requested her. Um, we're very, very, very pumped to have her on the podcast. So, And then hopefully like go to dinner with my dad, maybe Ryan too. But Big day ahead, so excited to take you guys along this week. And yeah, so tomorrow I'll be doing stuff with my dad. Tomorrow's my dad's birthday actually. Um, and my birthday's next week, so we'll be like celebrating our birthdays together, which is really special. Um, I have one fashion week event tomorrow night that he knows about. Um, but I actually am getting hair and makeup done today. So they're about to be here. So I'm just ice rolling my face. I think we're gonna do a sleek updo. That's kind of my vibe. And then Kat's doing my makeup, of course. And uh, I have to decide what I want to do for makeup because it'll be on all day for all different things. I'm, I'm just on camera a lot today, so I thought today was a good day. Um, yeah, welcome to the vlog, guys. <laughs> You always just yay. It's nothing new here. Cat slays every time. Thank you so much. The eye look. This is so versatile for the whole day. What's that? The hair. Yeah, the, the hair. hair. So good. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Cat just always does such a good job. I used a woman named Ileana Hair. She lives in Europe. She um, travels around between Paris and Geneva, Switzerland. Um, when she was in town. She does Camilla Coelho's hair a lot. Um, and my friend Mitchell had recommended her and I loved it. I just wanted to do the simple slick back Middle part with the spikes um, and I'm really happy So I'm gonna go ahead to Soho. I'm shooting with a photographer named Emily um, She's been so awesome. I've been really enjoying working with her this week Here's the outfit I am wearing and then I'm bringing another outfit in that garment bag over there So it's gonna be hectic and a little sweaty, so that's why I started with this outfit because it's just a little cooler. And then I'll put on my hot blazer. Um, but I like love this. These pants are so sick. Like, it looks like I'm wearing boxers and I'm here for it. If Ryan saw these pants, he'd be so confused. Top is Gooseberry Intimates. Necklaces are electric picks. I literally love electric picks right now and I love this like layered silver moment. I think I need to like keep these in my life. Um, then these earrings, also some silver double pierced. And then some silver bangles, and then these shoes are Black Suede Studio. So, I'm very excited. <laughs> Just got back, here is the other outfit I shot. I did not vlog, it was so sweaty. But isn't this epic? It's like a little Helsa set. These black fold-over boots. I just had so much fun! <laughs> 
Hello everybody. I changed back into this outfit because I just love it. And we're gonna go to Tegan's event. A little half-baked harvest LMS collab. I'm very excited. I literally use the cleansing balm every single day. Um, and I am so hungry. So I'm excited for some lunch. And I know for a fact Katie Bilotti's going. It's one of my very best friends. So that's always a plus. Um, I'm gonna bring the same bag with me. I'm gonna walk there. I'm gonna wear sneakers. I'm so excited to wear sneakers. I've been wearing heels all week. And it's in Palma, so that's West Village, very close to me. And then when I get back, my dad will be pulling up to my apartment, I think, which is always very exciting. I have you guys balanced. I'm just gonna put on my dirty Reeboks, but you know what? I've seen dirtier sneakers and, oh, it goes with the, oh, my socks. I don't think you'll see them. <laughs> I have no more time, so we can't really change the socks. You know what? We're rolling with it. Cause I wanna walk there, cause I've been in Ubers all week because of heels. So we're going sneakers. But yeah, today's been really fun. We took the coolest photos. I can't wait for you guys to see. Go follow me on Instagram, at Danielle Carolyn, so you can see them. Okay, you can't see the socks when I stand up. So we're gonna go, then I get back and my dad's here. I'm gonna record the podcast and dinner with my dad. Woo! The event was so lovely. I ended up seeing a ton of my friends. Kelly was there, so I was really happy to see her. Now I'm gonna pick up some dry cleaning and my dad is pulling up to my apartment as we speak. Okay, I raced home from the event. It was so lovely. And uh, my dad just got here, so he just rang the bell downstairs. My dad is like here now. Hello! Hello. Welcome, welcome. Didn't Say, open up both doors. Say hello. Hi, girls. <laughs> All right, quick change. We are now going to record the podcast with Morgan and Brooke. I literally just wore the outfit I wore yesterday because I couldn't decide, and I added some black cowboy boots. So in the studio hello hello so pumped we're about to do a full-on fun pod so fun we're ready <laughs> i'm literally so hungry i just got a pencil hey dad hey sweetie <laughs> he was chilling while we recorded the podcast i got back it took me forever to get back here new york city is alive and well right now and we are headed to Emilio's Bellato, which I was so excited to take him to. And I realized that he has been before, but he was like, you know what? It was so good, I would go again. So, highly suggest Emilio's Bellato. Come on, we're going. Uh -oh. <laughs> I'm like, we gotta go, because they don't take reservations, that's Can the only tell thing. Them who we saw there last time? Last time we were there, we saw Danny DeVito. Danny DeVito and my sister. <laughs> Couldn't resist it. Went up to the table and tapped him on the shoulder. It's like, I love you or something. We almost got thrown out because of that. <laughs> no, it's a really cool local vibe and you just feel it, it's the best spaghetti I've ever had. So we're going to go now and Ryan's going to join us. Go dogs. Okay. Bye, girls. Bye, girls. up at Parm. The line at Emilio's was way too long, but I love this place so much. And we're sitting outside. Such a good vibe. Nice and cozy. <laughs> Got his eye mask because it gets a little bright here in the morning, but this couch is way comfier than an air mattress, so. Happy birthday! It's a cozy Wednesday morning, and my dad's reheating his coffee. Today's my first, I have one Fashion Week event late tonight, but he said it'll be past his bedtime anyways, so we're good to go.
We're going to breakfast for my dad's birthday. Birthday breakfast. We're gonna have birthday lunch, birthday dinner. It's supposed to rain, but I think it's only gonna rain for like an hour today, which is nice because it's supposed to rain all day. This is my go-to, like, like I showered last night and washed my hair before bed and it was so gross this morning, so I just threw it up in a low bun with a hat. It's been my go-to. And then I usually put on like an exercise dress or a onesie. This one is from Beyond Yoga. New Balance sneaks, and I don't think I need like a jacket or anything. But today is gonna be a really lovely day. I just have a feeling because Aunt Debbie's coming to town for her brother's birthday, and uh, she's gonna spend the day with us. We're gonna do like an early dinner. Ryan's gonna join, I think. And then I actually have a Simkai event tonight, which I'm so excited about, but it doesn't start till nine, and my dad's like perfect. Honestly, like I'm gonna go to bed. So, cause I was trying to figure out if I could do that. And cause Simkai dressed me for the event, which is so exciting. Like I love their stuff. Um, so they gave me a couple options. Um, but I think I'm gonna go with this dress they sent me cause I picked it out and I was like, it's, it's so sick. But um, I also think I have a plus one. And if so, I wanna bring Kelly because she is like a huge Simkai girl. So getting that all figured out and yeah. Bag. I'm thinking we go to Cafe Clooney. It's a really nice vibe. Like 13 minute walk for September 13th. Oh, I should put on my 13 necklace. That's why I have a 13 necklace because it's both my dad and my brother are born on the 13th. My brother's January 13th and then my brother's soccer number was 13. So 13 is actually a lucky number in my family. My dad is about to try my favorite smoothie ever. And we got one for my Aunt Debbie too. Birthday smoothie. All righty. This is the OPP from Juice Generation. It's my favorite thing ever. We got one for my Aunt Debbie in case she wants one. And if not, an extra for me tomorrow. Yep. Cheers. Happy birthday. All right, so here's the game plan. Today is my dad's birthday. And we did this, I think, last year for your birthday too. I took him shopping. I think that's what we did and I bought him whatever he wanted. And so we're gonna do that today. And he said, okay, well for your birthday, it's my birthday is next Wednesday. We're exactly seven days apart, I think. Yep. Yeah. Um, he was gonna take me shopping. So we're taking each other shopping today and I can't wait. And then we were thinking, so my Aunt Debbie's coming today. She's almost here from Penn Station because she lives on Long Island. Her birthday's next month. So my dad was like, what if we go 50-50 and we buy her a gift today. <laughs> so we're just all buying things for each other today. It's gonna be so fun. Um, so yeah, I just did my makeup. I could not, I went to sleep with wet hair last night, so I just put my hair in a ponytail. I'm wearing this little dress from Revolve. It was supposed to rain all day today, and now it looks like it's not, but now it kind of has clouds again, so I'm not really sure. So we're gonna do a little shopping. I was kind of thinking we'd do a little Fifth Ave moment or Soho. They, there's a little bit of everything at either of those places, so I don't know. Do you have a preference? I think for Aunt Debbie, we've got to make sure it's a place that accepts re returns. Returns. <laughs> yeah, my aunt is notorious for turning anything you get her. 90%. Even if like she comes with us shopping today and like she picks it out, she'll probably return it because she changed her mind. <laughs> so yeah, we have to shop places that will take returns, you're right. Um, for her. For her. We will be happy with our purchases today. I'm on the hunt, I would love a, I told my dad this, I really want like a staple white or like creamy neutral bag, more so white, I think a white bag, cause I have, actually a white bag. I want a white bag, um, like a white shoulder bag of some sort that would just look good with any outfit, preferably no hardware, it's just like all white. Um, so I'm excited. And he, he wants like some nice jeans, we're going, we're having a day I today. I don't have much room in my luggage. I'm, he doesn't have much I, room. I, I He's got this extra space. and a little suitcase, so. Yeah, I'm filled up because I'm going somewhere else. He's going to Atlantic City after this. So, yeah, so while we wait for my Aunt Debbie, I actually wanted to show you guys something I just got. So you guys know I obviously love Brooklyn and sheets, Brooklyn and shower curtains, Brooklyn and towel, Brooklyn and everything. 
Um, and I got this in the mail the other day, and then I was like, wait, I need to show you guys before I make my bed. So you guys know how much I love the core sheet set. These are the Lux Sateen sheets. I literally use these in my apartment at all times. I feel like I'm sleeping in a hotel. You guys know we have a light, I have a light pink as well, which is really nice that we had as a part of our Gals on the Go bundle. I just discovered that they have this color, which is perfect. It's like this light brown tan taupe situation. I got it because it is officially spray tan, self tan season, and that's the only thing with white sheets. I'm I pretty much wash my sheets every Sunday, but you know, you get the little brown spots from spray tan, so I got these, and I'm so pumped. I'm about to get a spray tan um, in the next few days or just do some self tan. I haven't decided which one, and this is perfect, so if you sleep in your tan, I feel like you won't see it, so I'm very pumped about this. So yeah, if you guys didn't already know, Brooklinen is a luxury sheets company. They create high quality home goods that definitely elevate your home. Um, I feel very elevated now that I have Brooklyn in sheets. I'm trying to get my mom to have all Brooklyn in, in the house just because it's, I just like to invest in sheets that are gonna last me a long time. So now these will be my fall winter sheets. And then my white sheets are, you know, for the spring and summer or whenever I'm not self tanning essentially. They have all different types of sheets though. Like right now on my bed, I have the washed linen sheets, but then there's also the classic percal and then there's the luxe sateen of course. Whatever you end up going with though, I suggest getting the hardcore bundle because you're getting the best deal. You're getting pillowcases and then you're getting the sheets and then you're also getting the duvet cover with that. So this one's just the core sheet set because I already have my Brooklyn and white duvet. Um, but if you get the hardcore, you get the duvet already in it. So yeah, it's super easy. You can go online and you can build your bundle. You can actually pick and choose the color. So if you want a different colored duvet and then a different colored sheet, you can totally do that. It's super customizable and there's so many different color options. So I really like that. But like I said, I just got this color to go with my white duvet cover. So yeah, my anti bay isn't here yet. So I'm going to make the bed now because I just like need to see how this looks. I think it's going to be a nice pop under the white duvet. So luxurious and I actually really like how it looks with my white duvet cover I think it's a nice like when you fold it open it's like a pop of color oh I absolutely love this I wish I did this forever ago so yeah like I was saying if you do the hardcore bundle it actually saves you 25% and if you want to get $20 off your Brooklyn in order that's over $100 you can click the link down below and enter my promo code Danielle C so yeah you guys can enjoy it for yourselves thank you so much for Brooklyn in for sponsoring this portion of the video I love Brooklyn in you guys already know that so it's a very exciting thing when they want to work with me what do you think of the smoothie? Mm, good. It's good. delicious. Okay, so my Aunt Debbie, I'm just about to start opening, got me something from Ditteek. It was in a beautiful box. Card. And I told them the bag so you could reuse it. Oh yeah, oh that's nice, thank you. Yeah, she shipped it here but didn't know it would be like here when she came to visit. So I get to open it in front of her. I see so many goodies. So Some sick. of those might be mine. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. Ditteek Paris 5. Ooh, what's this? Oh my god! Wait, we saw this that day! Well, this so you put it over a candle. No, no, there's a bottom in there. So you put a candle in yeah, there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, but no, like I, if you don't like this one, you could just change. No, it. I feel like I was with you that day. And I was like, oh, so this is it makes it look right? so beautiful. So a candle that's just pure wax? No, 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 any kind of candle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so then there's look, a candle to do. Oh no, that not fit. Oh. This is my favorite scent. It is? The base scent. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm glad you had your favorite scent. I thought, I thought you knew all this because I wanted this. Like I liked when that day well, we were there last year. they have one that's fluted and then like if this is swirled with a black and I thought that was more interesting. Then they had another one so I wasn't sure. And, oh my gosh, it smells so It looks good. like it's going to be for pure, well that one will fit in it for sure. Yeah. 
Does it have the, yeah. So let's see how it looks with that. Oh my gosh, it's gonna look so good because they had it in the store lit up. I remember at the West Village yeah, one. Yeah, see? I am obsessed. Oh my gosh, thank Aww. you. That's so nice. Happy birthday. And then I can reuse this. Obviously, this runs out. Yeah. But and you know what you do with these? I read about it. When you're done with it, you can put it in the freezer and somehow, like, the wax has oil in it and then it comes right out. Oh, like it, so you could use it. And the... then you could put makeup brushes in it. Oh, I actually should definitely do that. Because I yeah, always need like, like little candle holders. You could so the wax if it's stuck on it, you put it in the perfume notebook. I went on. Oh, that's it. It like came with it. Yeah, yeah. The, I, I okay. guess the day that I. Does it have a smell? It smells good, maybe, but it could also just be from. Yeah, I smell. It smells powdery, like right. And then some fun samples. Okay, oh yeah. my gosh! Thank you. <laughs> Yeah, this is the best kind of gift. Oh my gosh! Like I'm glad there was another one, and I was on the edge with it. I like this one. It, it had I'm happy. Supposedly All right, here is the shopping fit. Shoes are Jeffrey Campbell. I literally love these so much. I'm just. It's still warm outside, so I'm wearing my summery outfits. Dress is Revolve. I love this. I will have it linked below. And I thought maybe me and my dad could get a cute picture because our outfits go. We're wearing black. Our outfits go well. They coordinate. Woo! We have to decide. Do you want to go to Soho or Fifth Ave? You decide <laughs> based on the purse. <laughs> now he's saying he wants Brooklyn and sheets. Did I influence you? He's like, you could just get me Brooklyn and sheets. I heard you talking about it. I said, I like a pair of those. <laughs> yeah. those. I mean, that's easy. But if you see something today, still tell me. Yeah. But I'll also get you Brooklyn and sheets. Um, because they're amazing and they make yeah, you just yeah. literally feel like you're in a hotel if at all times. They're half as good as you said. I'll take them. They're more than half as good as I said. So, um, yeah, we'll get you some Brooklyn in. Now I'm kind of thinking we should go to Soho because it's more of a vibe. And the same stores are in Soho and Fifth Ave. Yeah, so, I'm not, I'm not a Fifth Ave kind of guy. he's not a Fifth Ave guy. I'll ask Aunt Debbie for the final decision, but I think so. So is where we were last night. had a fun time at Loewe. I found a really great bag. Um, they wrapped it so beautifully. So I was like, I feel like I need to do an unboxing just so I can experience it one more time. I literally love this brand right now. And all their pieces are, a lot of them are very classic. I feel timeless. So I got, it's called the Hobo something bag. Hobo mini, Hobo hammock bag. And uh, got a white one. And then my Aunt Debbie actually ended up getting the black one. That was our gift to her. So it was a fun little day. There's all kinds of unwrapping. I love the dust bag. It's the white one. <laughs> we were like making sure I had the white one, she had the black. So, little, okay, when you first see it, obviously it's beautiful. I love the structured bottom. But what I really liked about it was, so you wear it on your shoulder, just like so, has the logo on this side, a little bit of like an off-white, but actually one of my favorite parts about it, it comes with a charm, and Loewe actually has other charms where you can, you know, buy and add more, but look at this. Oh wait. Oh, there's stuffing in it. I was like, what's happening? Hold on. It's a little like structured without the stuffing. And there's a crossbody too. So there's three ways to wear it. There's crossbody, which I don't intend to do much. And then this is how it kind of looks when it's shoulder bag. And then, all right, as I was saying, bring it in like this, and then you tie it in a knot. How cute is that? I just didn't tie it in a knot right now. But this is so cute, it makes it so versatile. 
So I love, cause I have like other bags that I like to do this. This is probably how I'll wear it the most. And then there's a crossbody. So I love it and it fits a ton. So thank you very much. You're welcome, happy birthday. Thank you so much, I love it. So I don't normally do like unboxing like this anymore but I wanted to show you guys because they came along the experience, and it was a really great experience. Shout out Nicole and Kimmy for Soho at Soho Loewe. <laughs> I'm Kevin, the security guard. I'm Kevin, the security guard, who great. he was honestly so awesome. And he was giving, yeah. he was like, that one's not as versatile because I was trying on the Loewe bracelet bag, and he was like, you won't be able to fit anything in there. He was being awesome. <laughs> Another outfit change for the night, you guys, and I have one more outfit tonight. I know it's a, it's fashion month, baby. This is just for dinner. I haven't worn this dress from Abercrombie out yet and I love the drop waist and then it like ties in the back. I'll have it linked below. Kind of switched up my ponytail just a little bit. Same sandals, all same sex accessories. Out of this bangle from J. Crew. Where are we going tonight? St. Theo's. St. Theo's. We're going to dinner at St. Theo's for my dad's birthday and Ryan's joining us. So we're going to have a fun time. Had a lovely day. I feel like my vlog is all over the place. This is the most random vlog ever. That's why you guys watch, right? We're just doing all kinds of things. Yeah. What are you getting? I don't know how long it's <laughs> Birthday, dear dad. Okay, we are back from St. Theo's. We had the most fabulous dinner. Walked around a little bit after the final look of the day going to the Simkai event. I'm bringing my friend Cass. Um, and it's gonna be so much fun. Cass is a stylist, so um, I wanted her to be able to come and meet the team as well. So we switched to a silver moment. I have these rings. Earrings are anthropology. The dress is Simkai. I love it. It's like a sample they sent me um, to wear for the night, but it's so cool. And then I'm going to show you guys the shoes I'm wearing too. I think it pulls it all together. I'm telling you, it's silver. I'm just like having fun with it. So I pulled the silver all together with these shoes from Kurt Geiger. So I think it's a fun little look. I really just love all the drapery and the buttons and the cutouts. I'm happy with it. It's a fun dress. The event tonight is actually at a venue called The Ned, which is a hotel, but I think it's also like a social club or something. So I've always wanted to go, so I'm very excited to go to an event there. It's like a cocktail party. Um, but yeah, I, I, I'm finding out there's like Fashion Week stuff tomorrow that I'm invited to, so I'm like, Fashion Week is a long week, man, and I'm loving it. Oh, and then I'm using my new bag. How cute. I love. I love. Hey guys, I'm home. The event was so fun. Dad's about to go to bed. I get to sleep in my new brown Brooklyn in sheets, which I'm very excited about. Just turn on my red light here. It's not even 11 o'clock, it's 10.55, and I had so much fun. I got to meet Jonathan Simkai, which was really cool, and saw some peeps, and was there for an hour as I wanted, and now we're home. So it's perfect, I will see you guys in the morning. I plan on walking. God. Good morning. The curtains are back open. They haven't been open in a minute, actually. We had breakfast. I just showered. Dad's all packed up. He's about to head over to Atlantic City. And he's helping me fix all kinds of random things. Oh, I didn't even show you guys. We hung up my grease photo, finally. That's me swimming in Santorini. And I like I like these two together. I initially... Oh, no. I didn't realize that was you. Now I remember the That's picture. me. I yeah. Know. I forgot you. I never really looked at it like that was you. I, I know, that's me diving yeah, in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who took the picture? Uh, Delaney. It's actually a video and I took a screenshot of it. It's pretty good quality. Yeah. I initially was gonna have it over there, but when he like held it up and I stood back, I didn't like how it was right next to the mirror. It just, 
didn't look right. And I like how it ties in with the Grey Malin photo, so. Burning the candle my aunt got me. It smells so good. Like, diptyque candles just really fill a room, which I appreciate. The Brooklyn and sheets were fabulous last night. Highly recommend. Doing some laundry. I'm washing, like, my bath mat and towels since my dad used them as well. It feels a little like fall outside. It was really lovely out. Dad is gone, and now I'm making some lunch. Really quickly before we head out to today's events, I just did my good old rice and chicken. As I've said before, I've been really trying to get better about, even if I'm in a rush, like finding easy meals to make that are nutritious and filling, so this has been good for me. I don't have much time, but I really do have to go. Um, so we are headed to Soho. We are starting off the day. I love my outfit, you guys. This dress, it's from Odd Muse. I'm obsessed, it's so cute. Like the waist and the little A-line moment. And I love a cap sleeve. We are starting off the day in Soho. I'm getting interviewed by Bailey Taylor for It Girl TV, I believe is what it's called. I'm really excited. She's just been interviewing people on the street. Um, but I'm just gonna casually be over there. No, we have it all set up, so I'm really excited. Um, so I wanted to wear a cute outfit, and then from there we're going to another Vogue event. So I'm wearing this dress from Odd Muse. <laughs> Red diesel bag. Heels, Kurt Geiger, the same ones I wore last night. And then my earrings are Jenny Bird. Let's go! Hi guys, I'm here with Bailey. We just did an interview for her It Girl series. Want to tell everyone a little bit more about it? Yeah, so I host a series on Bespoke TV called It Girl. And we talk about our New York City It Girls <laughs> that are, you know, business women, fashionable, cool, nice. It girls are nice girls. I nice always girl. say that. Only <laughs> it girls are nice girls. And we interview, you know, women like Danielle and talk about their amazing fashion. And we are trying to get Danielle for a closet tour. So if you want a Danielle closet tour give on video it thumbs girl, up. Give, it a, give it a like. And we will show you a little sneak peek of her closet on Bespoke TV. Ah, thank you, Bailey. I'm so excited. I can't remember if I showed you guys a full body moment. I just can't get over the stress. I don't want to take it off. I've had just the most lovely day. I guess I could keep it on for the event I'm going to later. This is the fit all together. I love these pointed heels. I need more pointed heels like this. They're so flattering. Um, but the events were so lovely. And I actually have like an hour and a half to chill before my last event. So I think I'm gonna literally sit on my couch. It's gonna be nice, I'm pumped. If anyone's wondering what I'm up to, I just ate a whole bag of popcorn and I'm watching Gossip Girl. <laughs> All right, last outfit change of the day. Going to the Brandon Maxwell showroom. Not doing a show this season, but he's doing a showroom, so. from the Brandon Maxwell event. It was so awesome. I wish I could buy other clothes all the time because their stuff is so cute. I just changed into this outfit. I'm looking a little disheveled right now. It, I hate to be that girl, but it actually does feel like fall outside today. There's just this Christmas in the air. This blazer's from the brand Bardot on Revolve. And then I'm wearing some girlfriend denim jeans. And then my boots are from Walmart. And then my bag. And yeah, but Ryan and I are actually gonna go to a chill dinner tonight. I ran into Bridget and Clea at the event as well, and I asked them where I should go with Ryan tonight, and Bridget said we should go to Lupe's, which is in Tribeca. It's like casual Mexican. That also sounds so nice, so I think that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna change into something just casually easy, fun. I haven't gotten to see Ryan a ton this week and last week because of Fashion Week, so we wanna just have a wholesome, fun evening. Maybe we'll walk all the way down to Tribeca. Whoa, look at my windows right now. Cause it's like getting darker. I love the blue 
Um, anyways, I'm gonna change <laughs> into another outfit. Oh my god, I said this is my last outfit of the day, but I'm hot. So. <laughs> Yum. Hi. Yum. Brian's taking me to his new favorite spot to get me flowers. Got my flower guy. He has a flower guy, so I get to witness it. I'm excited. <laughs> oh, thank you. It's so sweet. These are so pretty. listening to the up soundtrack it is truly amazing i was walking through washington square park last night and they were playing the movie up and it made me think of that song that song i used to listen to during study hall with my best friend caitlin when we were stressed it's so lovely um i'm just listening to movie soundtracks this morning clearly just lit a candle put on my robe it's like 8 30 put on a face mask i actually love this face mask so much it's the Peter Thomas Roth Water Drench Cloud Mask, Hyaluronic Cloud Mask. It's literally gel, and you just slather it on over your face for a few minutes, and it really just moisturizes your face. I'm in a lovely mood. It's nice to have a somewhat leisurely morning this morning. Um, definitely, it's a leisurely morning. I brought my Ember Mark back out because I forgot how amazing this thing is because whenever my dad visits me, he likes to use it, and I just forget how nice it is to have hot coffee, like... The whole time I am gonna start taking this my dad takes it it's called bulletproof unflavored inner fuel prebiotic it's just a way to get your prebiotic in without taking a pill I've done or supplements I take a lot of supplements so I was like let's just see what this is like um, I really like other prebiotics as well but I was like let me just give this a shot I wonder if there's a scoop yep there's a scoop my dad claims you can't taste this at all, so I'm going with that. All right, so we're gonna do one scoop of the prebiotic in here. Really hope my dad's not letting me down here. But I also put cream in as well. He drinks his coffee black, but I need some cream. I guess I'll like mix it together. Oh my gosh, this could be disgusting. Or really good. It's like, oh my God, I don't know you guys. I'm getting nervous. <laughs> All right, let's give her a go. Okay, update. I just tasted it. You cannot taste it, but I feel like it's still a little clumpy. So this isn't sustainable for an every day. I need to text my dad. I put one scoop, but I don't know, fam. We're gonna sit here and enjoy my coffee. I will keep you guys posted on how the whole thing tastes with the powder in it. I can't get over these flowers Ryan got for me. It's so cute that he's a flower guy now. Now I shall resume married life and sit here and drink my coffee. You think I'm joking, but I'm full on serious. Fun fact, La La Land soundtrack, I also love the epilogue, so good. Okay, I took my mask off and now we're about to get some work done here. I've been doing well daily. I already wrote stuff down last night that I need to get done. These blue light glasses, my eyes don't hurt. And guys, my coffee is literally still steaming. I forgot how amazing Ember mugs were. And the prebiotic powder, you get a couple clumps here and there, but I literally can't taste it, so that's always really exciting. Good morning, guys. It's Friday. Did I already say that? Yeah. I just took a shower and got ready for the day. Um, today's a big appointments day. I cleared my inbox this morning, which is one of my favorite things to do. I don't know. It just makes me happy. Putting on some Hoka sneakers because we need to be comfortable today. Um, starting off by getting my brows done, I go to Sanya's Brow Bar. Um, they're amazing. I, they just trim, they tweeze, and they fill out your brows. And 
The technique they use is so amazing. I really love going there. I go to Suzy. I highly suggest it. Um, and then from there, we're gonna get a wax. I haven't gotten one in a while, so I'm like, <laughs> but I'm just in the mood to just get a wax. And then from there, I'm gonna walk to get my nails done and that'll be like my workout for the day because it's like a 30 minute walk. Um, I broke a nail the other day. I've probably had these nails for four weeks or maybe even a little longer and they're, they're ready to go. Um, but yeah, I broke this nail. I think I'm, I always do chrome. I pretty much have done chrome forever at this point. I'm just gonna do white chrome, but this is my little outfit for the day. I really like it. This top is so comfortable and stretchy. It's from Target. I'm actually not even wearing a bra. It's so comfortable. Headband is Jerf Ave. I can't tell how I'm feeling about it, but I just wanted my hair out of my face. Um, earrings are electric picks. Skirt is Spanx. Sneakers, hokas, and then like just some Amazon socks. But yeah, it's a fun little chic outfit. We're gonna go get all of our beauty appointments in because my birthday's next week, so I just kind of starting all that now. Go with this bag, some crossbody, sunnies. Yeah, I think this is a cute running errands outfit and it's comfortable so I can do all my walking. I'll probably get a smoothie after I get my brows done. I'm so excited. Here's a little before. My skin's also just not being nice to me right now. I think it's because I've had intense makeup on every day for the last like seven days. <laughs> all right, let's go run some errands. with like turkey, lettuce, tomato, provolone cheese, onion, and oil and vinegar. It is just the best lunch ever. Um, I'm now going to finish doing the rest of my emails, clean up my closet room a little bit. It's all over the place. And I'm gonna start a weekend in my life vlog. So no worries, more content to come. I love you guys so much. Thank you again to Brooklyn Inn for sponsoring this video. And I'll see you guys next time for our next video. Bye.